Hey Stampers! Welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey and today I'm excited to share with you a fun new product that's in the annual catalog. It's these pigment sprinkles. If you um, have been familiar with Stampin' Up! over the last year, we had, in the last catalog, we had Brush Show, which it's a, it's basically the same thing, only the cool thing is this is Stampin' Up!'s own product. So it is our colors. It's Stampin' Up! colors, which is so fantastic, and I'm so excited about this product. So it's on page 179 in the catalog down here, and it's $23 for six little containers of the sprinkles, which will last you forever, I'm telling you, forever. So I want to show you what the colors look like and some projects that I've made using the colors, some different techniques with them. I love this product and I think it adds such a fun texture and variety to your cards. So let me show you. I'm going to start. Oh, another thing I wanted to mention was Stampin' Up! has a new watercolor paper that they've come out with and it is awesome. I've played with it a little bit and it's just a really great watercolor paper. It, the quality of it is really, really up there. So that's been really fun to play with too. So I'm just gonna show you the different colors. I'm gonna start, we have Melon Mambo, Mango Melody, Daffodil Delight, and then in the cooler colors, we have Gorgeous Grape, Bermuda Bay, and Granny Apple Green. So I'm gonna show you kind of the warm colors and the cool colors and kind of how they go together. So. I, the, one of the cool things about how they've packaged this is they have a little lid with the color on the top. You just screw that off and then it has this little plastic lid inside that you can just pop up. So before we had to like poke a little pin in there so that we could get the color and now they've made our job so much easier and I love it and we can store them and they're, they're great. This is going to be so awesome. So you just take your, your color. This is the Melon Mambo and I'm just gonna kind of get some sprinkles out around the paper and then close it and just put my lid back on. So easy. And then my Mango Melody, just do the same thing. Get some color on there and then Daffodil Delight. And I found it interesting when I did the sprinkles, the Mango Melody and the Daffodil Delight look so similar before they're wet. Like I can't tell where I've done my Mango Melody or my Daffodil Delight, but once I spritz it, you'll be amazed to see the difference here. So I'm gonna stick a paper towel under here and I'm just gonna take, this is our Stampin' Spritzer. Um, you can get these from Stampin' Up! too. They come in a pack of two. And I just have this filled with water. And you can see kind of the magic come to life. Do you see how pretty? So much fun. And the colors are so bright and vibrant and so beautiful. So I wanna show you a card that I made with these three colors. Here's the card with that Melon Mambo and the Mango Melody and the Daffodil Delight. I used this stamp set, Here's to Strong Women. I loved the You've Got This Girl in there. I thought that was so cute. And I um, embossed with that, f the fun new shimmer black um, embossing powder that's in the catalog too. So much fun. Okay, I wanna show you the other three colors. So we have Gorgeous Grape, Bermuda Bay, and Granny Apple Green. So I'm just gonna do the same thing so you can see these awesome colors. We'll start with Gorgeous Grape, just like that. And then Granny Apple Green. Now this one, when I sprinkled it, I was like, oh, it looks kind of like orange, <laughs> but it really turns green, I promise. It's so cool. And then Bermuda Bay. And sometimes it kind of gets caught in there. If you just close it and shake it a little bit, then it'll come out perfect. And then I'm gonna do the same thing. Bring my paper towel back in here and spritz it. Isn't that amazing? So pretty! Those colors are so vibrant. Like, it is amazing. I, it's amazing. That's all. <laughs> so pretty. So let me show you the card that I made using these colors. I used that same stamp set, the Here's to Strong Women, and it says, Courage is your superpower. And you can see the colors behind. I just put a vellum piece 
over the top and use the gorgeous grape paper behind and so much fun. I love, love, love those colors together. Okay, for my next card, I wanna show you a new technique that I kinda came up with using this one. So I'm gonna take, again, just a piece of watercolor paper, and then I'm gonna take a paper towel, and I'm gonna use the Bermuda Bay, the Bermuda Bay sprinkles, and I'm gonna sprinkle it right onto my paper towel. Get a good little amount on there. And then I'm gonna spritz my paper towel. Now, this is not a very clean activity. So if you're looking to do something clean, this isn't your forte, but it looks awesome. Okay, here I go. Spritz that right on my paper towel and get it pretty saturated and wet. And then I'm just gonna kind of squeeze that together. And I'm gonna take that color and I'm just gonna rub it all on my watercolor paper. And I feel like I a little bit need some more water on there, which is fine. I just spray it again and see my fingers. It's not very clean, but look at this cool color that you get. It's almost like a, a pearlized blue color there. Really pretty. Just kind of rub it all over. Just like that. Okay, I'm gonna um, let that completely dry, which I have one already done. And then I wanna take, put my lid back on my Bermuda Bay. I wanna take the Granny Apple Green here and I'm going to sprinkle it right directly on to this Bermuda Bay. Just like that. And then, I'm gonna spritz this just like I did before. And look how cool that color is. And I'm gonna kind of just daub it off a little bit. Cause I don't want it to run too much on this one cause I want the blue to be able to stay a little bit better just like that. So then I took, after I, I did all my sprinkles on here, I took the champagne shimmer paint and alcohol and I put it in this spritzer and you get two in a package. So you, one for water and one for your shimmer paint, your shimmer mist. And I just sprayed over the top of the sprinkles so that you get a really cool shiny look. Let me pull in the full card here so that you can see what I did. So it just says, you've got this girl. I used that stamp again and I embossed it in the shimmer white embossing powder. That's new in the catalog as well. And it just gives a really fun, shimmery, bold, bright card, which is awesome. So that was a fun one. Let me show you a few more that I came up with using this product. So this is one that I did the background here. Here's to strong women. So I used the Bermuda Bay and the Melon Mambo and some of the Mango Melody on there. So pretty. And then this last one, I actually didn't use the sprinkles on it, but I loved this saying in here, so I had to make up a card with it. It says, you deserve a whole sheet of gold stars. And that's, again, in this Here's to Strong Women stamp set. And so I just stamped on the back there the whole sheet of gold stars which is so awesome. So I hope that you've enjoyed learning a little bit more about the new sprinkles that by Stampin' Up. They're so much fun and I've loved using them. I love that it's our colors, Stampin' Up colors, so they coordinate perfectly with our paper and everything else. If you're interested in making a purchase, make sure you visit us at stampinjill.com and make sure to give us a thumbs up if you liked the video. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.